Good. How are you? Good. Good. I'm great. Hi, Hi Philly. How are you? Come on. Hey, good morning, Cal. Hi, Bob. Hi, Bob. The Peace Abbey is for everybody, but the students are the centerpiece. Okay. Great. Good morning. Good morning. Hey, Richie. One morning a week, the students come to the Peace Abbey to share in morning meeting. Connection is really what morning meeting is all about. As the bowl is passed from person to person, there is no conversation. We just allow this ritual, this gesture to communicate for us. The students enjoy the drying of one another's hands because they rarely get an opportunity to reach out and help people less fortunate than themselves. Each and every time that I participate in morning meeting, I'm deeply moved. Because it's probably the most authentic thing I'm gonna observe in the course of that day. I find I learn a great deal about myself when I'm with them. I know that if I'm not sufficiently patient, I don't see their gift, and uh, nor do I see my own. The students at the table come with a variety of life challenges. Bobby, who has Down syndrome, clearly is one of the most heartfelt individuals. For Sandra, who is on oxygen, she's more challenged physically than others. But as the fingerprint goes from person to person, it affirms our connection. It says non-verbally, we acknowledge and we celebrate our uniqueness and we accept each other for who we are. After we conclude our silence, oh, Father, Son, oh, Sister, we then recite the morning invocation, which is an adaptation of the Apache wedding prayer. My hope for the young people is that they'll continue to be affirmed in their spiritual nature more than anything. That we may walk fittingly where the birds at the end of the meeting, we share the special Peace Corps creed. When I am hungry, send me someone to feed me. When I am thirsty, send me someone who needs a drink. If in the course of our days we can all create opportunities to have this level of sharing, the world would be a better place. And when I think only of myself, draw my thoughts.